guys, this is an explanation of how to use volumetric flasks. So we have different size volumetric flasks, and each of those will have a ground glass stopper that goes in the top. Typically, you're going to want to you're going to want to make a solution in the flask. You might be dissolving a solid or diluting another solution. But the way to use these is to measure out the amount of uh, whatever you're going to put in there that you need. So I've weighed out some uh, a compound here in a weigh boat. Um, so I know how much this weighs, the, the compound itself. And so I add it into the, the flask. Make sure I get it all in. And then I add my deionized water to dilute it. So the way to um, use these is first add enough deionized water so that the flask is, oh, maybe about half full or so. And then make sure you get your um, compound to dissolve, or if it's a solution, get it mixed up. So let's see if that'll dissolve. A little bit left undissolved, maybe a little, um, yeah, there we go. So, that's air bubbles. I got all the solid to dissolve. So at this point, my goal is to bring the volume of solution in this flask up to the mark. There's always a mark somewhere on this neck right here. It's a thin line, and this one ends up being right here. Sometimes they'll be up here, down here. You find the mark, and what you need to do is get the bottom of the meniscus, there will be a meniscus, just touching the top of that line. And it's also very important that that line is right at your eye level so the parallax does not give you a false reading. So the way to do it is to add deionized water until you're just a little bit below the line from your wash bottle. Just bring it right on up. So I'd probably come up to about, oh, there or so. So my line is right here. I, I stopped here. Now what I'm going to do, to bring the solution up to its final volume, I use a, a medicine dropper and add the deionized water dropwise. So remember, this at this point, this should be at my eye level. Not quite enough, so I need some more. Some more. When you get close, you'll see the bottom of that meniscus is just below the mark, and then one drop will take it right up to the mark. So right now, at this point, I am one drop probably below the mark. And there it was, one drop did the trick. So now I have it at the correct level. I'm gonna take the ground glass stopper, and put it in the top. Don't, put, don't push it hard, it'll just set it in there, it will seal. And I'm gonna mix the solution up. Turn it upside down, give it a little shake. Now I have 100.0, this is a 100 milliliter volumetric flask. So you can, this gives you the tense places, 100.0 milliliters here. And different volumetric flasks have um, different places to where you read them. Your, your professor will tell you how to read your volumetric flask.